<laughs> Mr. Benani, um, there's been speculation about coalition talks between the opposition parties. Today you held a news conference where you clarified this matter. Can you shortly summarize this for our viewers? We, I'm confirming that we have been having a lot of talks throughout the periods, talking about a lot of issues, uh, including electoral mainly including electoral problems that we're experiencing in the country and also the issues of, of possible co co cooperation and so forth. But at this point in time, uh, the speculation is misplaced and, and unfortunate because currently we are not talking about the coalition, we are, talking about, we, are talking about, we are talking about how best can we challenge the electoral problems that we are facing in the country. In the future, if we find agreement and concurrence on the matters of coalition, we will come to the country and brief them. But at this point in time, it's just premature to talk about it we, because we have not we have not really gone into the matter as, as as of yet. If we do, we will discuss it. If we don't, we won't. But we are looking at how best can we, as opposition parties, agree on changing the electoral process to make sure that we have a functioning democracy in the country. And the elections for regional and local government is coming up in November. How ready are the parties? The parties are working uh, around the clock to, to, to strategically place themselves in areas where they can make a, a, an effective contribution. And I think a lot of parties are really hard at work working, making sure that they are, they are prepared. Because you must remember these elections, these elections that are mainly uh, candidate-oriented candidate elections because you have to field candidates. And many parties are busy. In my own party, we are busy now with identifying the candidates for certain, uh, for constituencies and so forth. So we, we, we are building up the process at this point in time to get the candidates ready, agreement on candidates, and then move into the next level of, of now selling the candidates to, to the country. Any news on when we can expect the verdict of the Supreme Court? We have not heard anything at this point in time, and, 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 and we are really concerned that this matter is very urgent. Although we respect the, the independence of the judiciary, we, are, we must state that we are not really we are disappointed that we have not had the verdict at this point in time, knowing the agency of, of this case.